Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm still experimenting with this I2C digital temperature sensor and uh, displaying the temperature output. So in the first sketch we looked at the temperature uh, information using the serial monitor program and there you just see the straight um, numerical data output from this uh, digital temperature sensor. So if we open up the monitor program, tools, serial monitor program, you can see the data being displayed right there. You know, visually it's straight to the point. Uh, it uh, relays the information you need to know. And uh, it's kind of technical looking, doesn't have much of a visual impact though. But then we have the bar graph, which is more visual than uh, actual numbers. I mean, we could put like stencils next to it with the eight different temperatures that uh, we're using to light those LEDs. So the LED bar graph sort of just gives you a general idea of the temperature increasing and decreasing. And it's more visual than giving you a uh, hard numerical number. But why not have the best of both worlds where visually you can see uh, the real time temperature in degrees Celsius and degrees Fahrenheit and have a visual impact too. Because uh, what if you had a display that was important to an operator of a piece of heavy equipment or to uh, someone that was maintaining uh, a piece of equipment. You know, you just don't want this boring technical number. You like to have some visual impact too to get somebody's attention in case something's going wrong. In this case, if the temperature is too high or too low. So one example of the best of both worlds there, both the temperature and good visual impact might look something like this. A little bit different from the text numerical looking characters and the uh, bar graph. And this is accomplished with an open source uh, software language called Processing that helps you display and manipulate the data from the Arduino. If you just do a search of Arduino and Processing, it'll take you to the Arduino.cc uh, website and this web page here starts describing uh, the open source language development tool. And there's also a link here. Click on processing right here. And it takes you to processing to website. And it's the processing is a programming language development environment and online community. Since 2001, processing has promoted software literacy within the visual arts and visual literacy within technology. So this is all about taking data and manipulating it and uh, being able to visually present it in a better way than uh, just the plain text. So you can go to CNET and get one of the uh, free 30-day evaluations of uh, WinZip and then just download this file here if you want to donate, donate and uh, pick your operating system and unzip it to uh, a folder on your computer and you're ready to go, ready to use it. So definitely a nice uh, additional tool to have for experimenting with the Arduino. I recommend going to the website and downloading this software. I hope you found this video informative. Feel free to subscribe, like and or comment and thanks for watching.